Hey guys, you're watching Boom Docking with Dennis. That's Lamar Park right in front of us. We're in Corpus Christi, right off Alameda. And uh, a viewer had asked us to come check out her childhood home here in Corpus Christi. So we're going to go up Coral Street, which I believe is right here on the left. Yep, okay. Sorry, navigating while I yap is not my favorite thing. Look at these beautiful trees, wow. Yeah, I uh, I really like this area of Corpus. It's uh, some nicer homes and uh, really convenient. You know, the Corpus Christi Bay is not far, just a couple minutes away. Uh, Lamar Park is right there and uh, nice little shopping center with uh, a really nice restaurant that I enjoy, uh, Hester's. They have an awesome uh, brunch. Probably a little bit up further. That's Alameda if you're playing at home right in front of us. Gorgeous day. We did just get some rain. Did I pass it? I believe I passed. No, still going. Still going. Really nice homes. Every everything's well cared for. And there's just a homeless guy in a. There you go. There it is. And of course we're shooting right into the sun. Very nice. Let me see if I can get you a better angle where we're not glaring right into the sun. <laughs> Try it from right here. Simple house, but I, I really like uh, the bones of it. Nice trees out front. Looks like a single story. Maybe has a... I can't tell if that's the house behind it or if there's like a nice garage back there. Yeah, pretty. So, I hope that was a good enough uh, shots for you. Kind of hard this time of day. This is Alameda. And uh, I want to take you down to, I believe the actual shopping center is called Lamar Park. It's a pretty bumpy road, especially in this right-hand lane. So we'll take our time and get bounced all around that cool front is supposed to arrive this evening and I am hoping for it because I would like several nights of cool weather and good sleeping I wonder if I'd be any good at bronco busting from riding streets like this I, I feel like I have a good foundation for it absolutely amazing yeah Dotteridge is right up here at the lights I do remember uh, further up a lot of school zones so if you're ever in a hurry to get anywhere this ain't the street to take I used to drive a server worked up here at the village oh there's a Hester's truck right there I could have pulled right back there into that entrance I forgot about that I used to drive a server that worked up here at the village then she became a stripper kept her night job though but added a late night job good for her working two jobs good for her <laughs> Here's an entrance up here. And let me go to the second one so all the stores are on my left-hand side. They're easier to film. Park 7. Lamar Park Center. That's what this place is called. And I've driven quite a few people. So that looks like a fancy jewelry store or something. Park 7. I'm going to zoom out just a little bit. And then... Uh, I've taken a lot of passengers when I uh, was working for Uber and Lyft. 
to the post. And they have some really good food there, I've been told. I've never actually set foot in the place. I've been here a couple hundred times. Kind of a high-end bar, but with really good food. And they have, like, interesting things like duck sliders. That's an unusual place for a mailbox, huh? A couple mailboxes. But I like it. Dude's working. Interesting fountain there. It'd be cool if that was working. Let's go back to the front here. Ready for our little zoom zoom. Yeah, there's a bunch of uh, retail shops in here. Excuse me. Pothole. Don't worry, guys. I saw the pothole. I found it for you. That's pretty neat. Yeah, it's like not even 10 o'clock yet. But... This place, uh, Hester's, I'm pretty sure we've done videos from here before. Hester's Cafe, Bakery, Coffee. And then they have that really interesting uh, outside area with the vines. And you could sit out there and they have fans going. Pretty neat. There was three locations in Corpus, including one in the uh, Art Center. Art Center? Uh, South Texas Art Museum. The big one downtown. But I don't know if uh, it's still there or not. But there were three locations. This is the one I always came to. Eclectic Lifestyle Goldsmith Jewelers. Yola. Cocina Mexicana. So, restaurant? Bar? I don't know. Loft looks like a clothing place, so pretty neat, pretty neat little shopping center. It's good for the area, huh? Let's uh, I believe this street is Dotteridge. Dotteridge, am I saying that right? I don't know. Head down towards Corpus Christi Bay. So, what is this? A school zone. I'm going 29 and a 30. It's not a school zone. Just let me know my speed. Now I'm going 26 and a 30 because I am a wild man. Born to be wild. Sorry. Sorry. Sorry about that. We're going to cross Santa Fe. Yeah, there's a lot of neat stores in this area. I know there's a lot of schools. A lot. Uh, there's a hospital right, right in the area. I was be over here quite often doing uh, Uber and Lyft. Well, why are you over here today, Dennis? Well, I'll just lie and say I came specifically to film that uh, house. Someone watches my channel. I'm going to drive 48 miles to check out their childhood home. <laughs> why wouldn't I? Seems very cost effective. <laughs> Here's Corpus Christi Bay. Pretty neat. Oh, look. Construction. That's an effing surprise. <laughs> Here, look at this. Look at this dump. Here's a fixer-upper. I'll give you ten bucks. Final offer. Wow. Oh, that's the house with the uh, turret that I always talk about. That is pretty. I bet you they love uh, all the construction signs in front of their house. You know what? Let's be a big boy and use a turn signal. Ocean. Ocean Drive. Except there's no ocean here. I'm going to let it slide today. So I did not look up a joke. So I'm trying to think of a subject to remember a joke. And there's lots of bad jokes available. I always draw a blank in these situations, and uh, I'm not reaching for my clipboard off camera. Oh boy. Well, here's the joke I just read from the joke book, guys. 
not my best work. Look at this mess here. I guess I'm going to go over this lane. Yeah, we're supposed to get some rain today. Like I said, we did get a few drops coming over here. Hoping to uh, avoid any more rain. And I think it's still going to be hot and sticky when we go to bed tonight. And hopefully, at some point, the cold front will come in. But I don't know. Never know what's... Uh, there's the Kraken for a second. The hockey team, the Kraken, won last night. So I think they're one and one now. Not bad. Little park here. Oh, the joke. Uh, what do your dog and your phone have in common? They both have caller ID. Mm. I, I can't quite call that comedy gold. If, if you're around people that you don't like, please go tell them that joke. <laughs> Let them know that you're in charge and if they treated you better, you would tell them better jokes. That's a large group of trees for Corpus Christi right there. The city's about uh, 10 minutes up this road, the downtown area. But I did just want to take you guys on a little drive this evening. I hope you're doing well. I appreciate you guys. I hope you're nice and cool. And if you're in the cold area, I hope you're warm. And, uh, yeah. Get something good to eat. Have something good to drink. Have a good night's sleep. And above all, say it with me. Thanks for watching.